fall off. If y'all don't start commenting and sharing and subscribing, it's going to be me and y'all. Yeah. Stop playing with me. Comment. Hello, my fault. Go to the video. Hello. Bring some of that royalty. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Neek G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying and what the goddamn hell you league. So, before we even get into this, I want y'all to know I appreciate y'all for tuning in, man, the way you do, you know? I can't ask for better, you know what I'm saying? Because you, you ain't got to be here. You can be somewhere else. Appreciate the follow, friend. We about to get into this video, you dig? Now, this is Messy Monday, and it got to be messy. Let's get it. Girl, it is so much going on, but I ain't got nothing to do with it. It's a whole lot, a whole lot of going on. It's a whole lot, a lot of going on. It's a whole lot, a whole lot of going on. It's a whole lot, a lot of going on. It's Monday, and you know what that means. If it ain't about me, then I'm a kiki. First on the dock, and then I'ma talk shit. Got my sugar, honey, iced tea. Do you wanna sip now? Period. I said what I said. Now move along, bitch, before you get red. POP, you can't stick with me. Come on, girls, let's get. Hey creeps and welcome back to Messy Monday. As you already know, you can't sit with me unless you are POP and that is pretty on purpose. How you doing? Now baby, let me tell you something. This week, the girls was girling, but it's going on. Y'all just fighting just to be fighting. Like I, feel, I don't know if it's the renegade, what they call that thing? Retrograde. Thing, when the thing be thangin'. Retrograde. Yeah, huh. whatever. It's thangin' and the girls is acting up. So I'm not gonna hold y'all. I just wanna say hey to my friends and that is all of y'all. Hey, bitch. Thank y'all for riding with me. If you got my post notifications turned on on Twitter, I will be going back to shouting y'all out. But please go on over to Twitter. It is goddamn so G O T A M N Z O. Pretty girl rocks. I'm over here like. <laughs> I'm taking the time out to tell you that I. Looking at that hour is like, oh my god. <laughs> All right, let's go on and get into that first segment, and that is the shit, the sugar honey iced tea, because you girls love saying and some shit. First for the sugar honey iced tea, we have Megan versus Chucky. Now I know y'all are like, so what the fuck is this? Maybe this is a key key, and y'all know a bitch like me love the key. I was just on Twitter, and I was like, wait a minute. I know damn well this ain't Chucky fucking with Megan. <laughs> Wait a minute. So child, I get into the get down and I start surfing around and I'm like, oh, they fine. So Megan came out <laughs> on Twitter and she tweeted me, Megan, your new best friend. Megan! You sh Now. I know your only best friend is Chucky. Now, girl, if you really want to be real, your only best friend is my buddy. Now, I don't know if y'all know about buddy a long time ago. He wasn't no killer, but he was a black dog named my buddy. And, girl, they trying to take that shine from my buddy. Let's put it back on buddy. But, anyway, we're talking about these two white ones right here. So, Chucky said, everybody trying to be Chucky. And Megan said, I know you fucking lying. You know you get tall when you cause all this conversation. What? I said, well, bitch, you better see it pretty old. Because, girl, she had the girls in an uproar because I know I'm going to see Miss Megan on the big screen. But that didn't stop Chucky. So, when Chucky came back and said, word to the wise, don't fuck with the truck. <laughs> I said, boop, 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 you better. What? Bark Chucky because everybody knows Chucky is not the one to be played with. Chucky will really come through this door and light Miss Megan up. So Megan said, oh, well, oh, Chucky, please. No, Megan, I'm not trying to be funny, baby. I'm not trying to pick a side, pick a side. But it's all fun and games until Chucky go and get Tiffany. Now, when he gets Tiffany, bitch, girl, go late. Tiffany gonna rock your world. Now, everybody know. Tiffany don't play about Chucky, bitch. And these Yo. some grown motherfuckers trapped in these little bodies. You still a kid. So, girl, you might want to keep it cute. But I do got something to say to Chucky. Chucky, you didn't give Annabelle this same type of tea. Why won't you staff no Annabelle like that? Maybe Annabelle could beat Tim the ass. Maybe you got something going on with Annabelle. You sure didn't give Braun this same heat. And Braun came out with a couple of shows, honey. And you Yo. ain't getting nothing to Braun. Y'all. I can't believe you did that. 
go like Chucky. But Move the chat on the video. I don't know why y'all out here oh. disrespecting my bitch Chucky just because some little bitch came out here and did a little cartwheel. <laughs> <laughs> I said, okay. Cause baby Chucky be out here doing the most too, baby style. That's when uh Chucky gave his two sisters and said, you a real one. And then um Miss Megan came back and said, hit me up when you can do this. And then Chucky <laughs> said, well, bitch, you hit me up when you can do this. <laughs> <laughs> It is what it is. So, all right, y'all, that's gonna start off our Halloween. And if it ain't about me, <laughs> nigga, better watch out. Charles Lee Ray and Tiffany Nika. <laughs> Next to the Sugar Honey Ice Tea, we have Ken versus Daryl. Now, this really wasn't oh, a versus. They didn't say nothing to each other. It was no beef or anything. <sighs> but the girls sent this to me because they kind of caught the little shade. We all know Daryl like, throw a little light for Bimbo Shade, honey. So, Ken came out with his new little tenderoni, honey. It, is it said that they go together, but it's very much giving energy, child. To carve these pumpkins, but it's gonna be a competition. It's gonna be my pumpkin for show pumpkin. You sure you ready for this? So you, you see, you never carved a pumpkin before, right? I've only done it once. It's not that big of a discrepancy. You know the first thing to do? See? <laughs> oh, damn, oh, Ken had oh, a huge oh. ass pumpkin. <laughs> Y'all, why did they? You gotta clean it up. I literally just did my pumpkin. And it was not hard to do. Why are they making it look like it's so hard to carve that pumpkin? Ew, that doesn't look it like it. It was not I'm hard not at all. It's just my hands. Look at Ken. Like, you better hurt me up, because I'm digging in. Well, it ain't even <laughs> that hard. Okay. Can I help you? <laughs> <laughs> she really didn't, she didn't work out like the full special effects, like makeup. Yeah. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. Don't worry about it. No, stop. He's taking literally all of my ideas. No. Mind your business. I really Obviously, don't want we know who's to get that heart surgery. I really don't. Winner here. Me. Come on, you see this masterpiece, and you see this snag of tooth pumpkin over here. You know, my pumpkin has teeth. No teeth. Teeth. No teeth. Just remember that now when you go judge it. So the girls went to the comments, child. The girls said they look good together, girl. They was just giving all they the kids that it's supposed to have game, honey. And I'm just like, mm, okay, I see what's happening here. Then all of a sudden, after he dropped that little reveal, child, that little fake card, honey, Deanna going to put up her little photo shoot. You never carved a pumpkin before, right? I've only done it once. It's not that big of a discrepancy. You know the first thing to do? And then on the very last slide, it gave immediately. So I was just like. Y'all. Yeah. Me and Toot was talking about this today. And um, I, I seen this the other day. And I did not know that her caption and her location said unbothered. So I was like, what? I said, Toot, that shit. Child, she ain't bothered, right? Come to find out, her ass uh, drop, dropping an unbothered line. <laughs> this fucking Diera. Because at first, I said, wait a minute, Diera, now. Hold on, friend. Do you care? You know what I'm saying? But if she dropping an unbothered line and drop that right on time, I'm with the shit. Like, what is the really going on? I don't know. Maybe she put some type of way. I mean, I would too. If, you know, the man that had proposed to me is supposed to be my fiance, new husband, whatever the case may be, pop out with new bitch, bitch. And, girl. <laughs> girl. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, sis. She over there playing with plastic human and got the real thing. What? Why y'all spamming R.I.P.S. Dot? Like, did something else happen? If it ain't about me. Let's keep keeping. Okay. Next to Sugar Honey Ice Tea, we got. I mean, definitely RIPS that, but is he about to make a segment on it? Kendall versus Jay Z. What's up, Y'all trying to make me so sad? Or before something? I even say something, I don't want no clout. I, I don't know, want he none of off this but... video, but I'm very upset because I came to the City Girls thing because they said, oh, I won the good love giveaway thingy, whatever. I come all the way up here, they tell yeah, me, me oh, I'm give like, me the two names that you need. Happened? Me and my sister name. I sent them the names. September 22nd, here's the messages. Blah, blah, blah. Y'all read it, pause it, whatever. Not y'all read it, pause it, whatever. And when she said that, I said, oh, Miss Mama, for real. They didn't have her tickets at Will Cobb. Because she like, look, I don't give a fuck what you do. Either you read it, you don't, you do, you whatever. <laughs> Bitch, it's on you. I just gonna say what the fuck I gotta say. So anyway. So we get here all the way, mind you, matching and all, thinking we finna see somebody, a little exclusive something. Fun we get... So we get to the car booth and they don't know our name. They talk about some, no, we don't see you. I shot them the messages. They still don't. Before somebody go off on me in the comments, 
uh, y'all already know it's RPS that for sure. What, uh, I am very sentimental to certain things and I thought something else doesn't happen because randomly they put RIPS dot in the comments and I'm just like, what else happened? Okay. <laughs> so rest in peace to S dot for sure. I don't know why that came in the comments, but definitely rest in peace to him. Yeah. I, I still don't know why y'all put that in the comments, but, um, yeah, I hate sad news. We already done, you know, we had to deal with that. We dealing with death every day. Some things we just don't have to talk about. We already got to deal with it. You know what I'm saying? So I just want to clear that up for anybody thinking that anything less than me feeling, you know, any, you know, compassion for Esta. I just don't know why that got so serious, but yeah. I don't know us. So luckily, due to the situation, they gave us two tickets to the lawn. It's He's a YouTuber who used to do reaction videos um, with his girl. I don't know if she was his girl or his wife. But, um, yeah, he ended up having heart surgery. And then um, after the heart surgery, um, like a week later, I believe, he ended up passing away. And that's another thing. I don't know all of the information. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, it's just fucked up. And I don't want to talk about it. Said Lawn 12. So then I end up seeing Summer and um, what's the other one? Yeah. Ja. He waved at me. I wanted to say, baby, could you go get your oh, mother? Okay. Because, baby, why am I back here? Like, yeah, because I was, was not understanding. Now I understand. I've been through this before. Because me being last time pausing this, I don't want Ken to get um heart surgery either. I really fucking don't. And um, that shit is so sad, bro. It's so sad. But all right, let's and, you know, me being on Wild and Out, I've given names at Will Call or whatever the case may be. And then my people get there, they be like, so my name ain't on the list. Um, they don't see me. When I know that I gave the names in. You know what I'm saying? So sometimes it isn't the artist. It could be like the girl said, your management are just the facility and their people are running behind and not doing what they supposed to do. Now, to me, I don't think she said anything wrong about the kids. She just said she saw the kids on the lawn, but I guess that took offense to JT because JT probably like, bitch, first of all, you didn't see her children on the lawn. <laughs> bitch, again, they backstage or they up in front. What the fuck they doing on the line? So I guess JT saw the video, honey. She came back out, and we all know Miss JT is not the one to be played with. She is going to give you a good clap back, and baby, that is what she did. Then the girl said, uh, where was I lying? I was mentioning I saw her son, and I waved at him. The fuck? You ain't gonna tell him to retract what the fuck I said. <laughs> so then that's when JT came back and said, let me gather you together real quick, Miss Mamas. And she told her, you did not, first of all, see her son in the line. But then I'm like, why well, you tell this girl when she saw her son? Maybe they was going to the bathroom, but you know, I don't know, JT, obviously she know what she know, and this girl know what she know, and uh, whoever know, know the know. Why would he wave at you? <laughs> who are you? <laughs> and who are you for him to wave at? Damn. I'm like, damn, JT, <laughs> give it a rest. Let the girl breathe, get off her neck. You didn't get the seat she wanted, now you mad. <laughs> you were in the lawn <laughs> where you should have been. Yeah. You trying to go big when the situation could have been an easy fix. In the future, you mentioning her kids got me real mad. And I'm like, well, JT, you kind of went a little tough because maybe the girl could have been right. The girl, her name was probably not there. But then they end up giving her Girl, just, just went off she feel they threw at her, which could have probably been the tickets that she got for the lawn. But because her name was not already there, it made it seem like they just threw her in an old ticket. That's all. But baby, you be on go. So now the girl mad and she's gonna type in all caps. I did see her kids <laughs> and her son was on the lawn and he waved at me. <laughs> I'm like, girl, call that. <laughs> now you get it. She said, ask him who I am. <laughs> I thought she, Yo. she in JT's face. Now, like, girl, <laughs> this bitch what? done shook the <laughs> table. You what you not going to do? I am an influencer who had a follower so humble yourself who didn't have a seat. <laughs> 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 I'm like, Relax. Can you hear the video? My name wasn't on the list. It's <laughs> like, damn, how many times you want me to tell you, bitch, now I gotta yell at your ass. <laughs> so get your manager to learn how to co-op. Right, right. 
Yeah. <laughs> Yo. When you go all caps, you know you typing like this. So then somebody came back and told JT that her response was <laughs> kind of rude, whatever the case may be. Like, why are you always mad? So then JT came back and said, I, I don't, don't care, care Jamal, Jamal, for real. real. <laughs> hey, who are you, sir? Like, why are you even talking at this point? Were you there? It's including Jamal for me. <laughs> I don't you care, Jamal. If you weren't on the line, then you have nothing to say, Jamal. JT kind of gets, I guess, I don't want to say in her feelings, but she bent a little bit more. And she said she loved her real ones. She used to be sad and all this other good stuff. But now she don't really give a fuck. And then she went on to say as well, all her real fans, they um they paid for the tickets. That was real love. Woo, 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 yada, yada, yada. I'm just like, well, sometimes real, you know, some people do want some stuff for free and it feels good to get something from the person that you do really support. It don't mean that they don't support you. It's just that I hear that y'all getting right free tickets, bitch. I don't, I'm not gonna lie. People, <laughs> people think that I be fanned out, which is crazy because I just be reacting to things that I would be watching if um, I wasn't on this computer. <laughs> But I, I would never fan out over none of these influencers because they all are very disrespectful. They all have their own disrespectful ways. Okay? I'm gonna give me a free ticket. Everybody's gonna go stop free from Curtis Hood. So then child of fans kept getting upset. They said, well, girl, she was a real supporter when she came to the concert to support you without no support. Then, baby, there's no brand. Okay. And that is true. Even if it was a free ticket or not, she's still going to be like, oh, girl, fuck this free ticket. I'm going to go somewhere else. But she still came. We winded on down, and more people are still upset about the situation. And then one of the girls said, I was going to come to the show that's in Atlanta, but bitch, I would just stay home. So I don't like your attitude. And then, then she said, well, stay home, peaches. <laughs> He's stupid as hell. What do you say after that? Like, well, I'm going to stay home. I ain't going to lie. I'm over this. You say this shit already okay. an hour. Like, oh, we're just going to get them out of our face and gave us any random tickets. So we did not get in due to the giveaway like y'all told me. Uh, once again, here's the messages. Right here, y'all promised me two tickets. I didn't say that I needed backstage or anything, but my name wasn't on the thing. And I went all the way up there. My sister flew in town for this as well. So y'all, we one, two, three, four, five, six. We did see y'all in summer. I'm not mentioning her kids in no type of disrespectful way at all. I'm just saying that I seen them and he even waved at me. He was with Tyrus and I even called Maya later. Aroma. <laughs> Sachi versus uh, Martel Hort. Anyway, Hold fuck up. So, child, this is a mess. Now, she posted this. At, at, at this point, we don't give a fuck, okay? We, we don't care. I don't, we don't care how many times he called you. One, two, three, four, five, six. We don't care how many times you didn't come get the baby. We don't care how many times, <laughs> how many times. 2021. <laughs> <laughs> now she wanna post all this. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, you little booshy. I love I how see. we be on the same page. Hey? White versus T.I. and King Harris. Boy, you little booshy, son. Little boy ain't never been across his goddamn head. Booshy, your boy don't know how to fight. Neither do that T.I. little yellow motherfucker. Long hair free. That little motherfucker don't know how to fight either. Get them y'all babies is rap babies. Go drop him off over his cousin them how. Well, one of them cousins might uh, not let him eat. And then see if the boy can hold up in Baton Rouge. Right now, look Tootie Raw, you ain't nothing but a little shelter, little ugly ass, little black ass, little boy that look like a pair of patent leather boots. Your daddy look oh, like a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You look like a pair of patent leather boots. Boy, trying to fight, you's a bitch. Boy. Hey. Hey, much your Your citizen, that's a threat. <laughs> I'm a comedian, and I <laughs> ain't got the respect. No, you know, just teachings as but I know his son's still young, so he that's why everybody.
life on the fence about whoop 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 y'all. Yeah, you don't get you or whoever. Phone. Now, you never even talk to each other. Family. Boy, ain't no way we still go. The community have absolutely nothing to say. Nigga, are we still I'm going? With uh, not knowing that they, nah. you know, that they were. Okay, I do want to talk about this YK love. Osiris yeah, thing. Definitely so want to talk about that. That's with, uh, Trey. Did he just get that little girl tattoo on T.I.'s son is in your response. He got that. I'm going to have YK Osiris. Now, this just came out of nowhere because I could have sworn he was just hanging out with, uh, Trey. Did he just get that little girl tattoo on him? And he got that other little tattoo. He just he's got these it. men stuff tatted on him, and now he said these folks ain't fucking with him. Oh. Y'all keep using that Drake shit, huh? I watched this last night, child. I had me all in my feelings. I had to go to sleep. Drake don't fuck with me either. Me and Drake don't talk. Me, me and the baby don't talk. Nobody in the industry fucks with Osiris. Nobody, so don't keep using that shit with me. Like, you can't keep using that. Like, stop. Like, we don't fuck with you. nobody. We don't like. We don't talk. The baby don't fuck with me no more. Drake don't fuck with me no more. But nobody fuck with Osiris. So why the fuck I keep living? Like, I should tell y'all that y'all y'all not getting it. Like so you tell so you tell me why should I keep living? I don't I don't get it. Like why y'all saying like y'all y'all would tell me all the type. Of, I'm giving y'all explanation. I'm not gonna say what the word on the curb is saying, but y'all know what the word on the curb is saying. If somebody's not my friend, I don't give a fuck if you're my Nah, cause fuck all them folks. I mean like real shit. I was gonna make a video about it, but damn it, it's on here. Let me tell y'all something. Fuck all them folks. Do you hear me? Fuck all them folks. <laughs> okay. I don't give a damn about Drake, little baby, da baby, none of these niggas. I care about me. And I don't know if he's trying to fit in, you know, and it's very, very, very sad that he feels that way because, you know, we have to have some type of compassion for people who do feel that way. I feel as though, because we all have been there. But fuck them niggas, all of them. My friend and I, unless y'all are doing some shady, evil shit behind the scenes that is just fucking up my income and my life. Word. But if you're just not talking to me, I don't give no fuck. I'm sorry. <laughs> Word. But some people do depend on others to feel loved. I don't, I don't know if YK don't have a family. I don't know, but ooh, I, I just hope this boy find peace because whatever these men done did done really hurt this young man. I don't know, y'all, because didn't, uh, didn't Drake shit that girl out there? What's her name? Ice Spice. He done shipped Ice Spice out there, follow her and everything. Then he shipped her back home and unfollowed her. Maybe she didn't give him no coon. What the curb saying? What's the word on the curb saying? You know? It's a whole lot of, whole lot of, it's. Drake flew out Ice Spice and then unfollowed her. <laughs> Boy, if I tell y'all, I ain't gonna say that, Nate. Mm -mm. No, no, no. Just know. Child, these views going up a little bit and everybody is coming out the woodwork. It's like, nigga, <laughs> where the fuck was you at when I was fucked up just now? Where was you at? Now, my number's going up and I want to reach out. Hey, big head. Like, girl. Girl. Girl, girl, I hope he can find some new friends. I just want to say this. I'm so glad I experienced Let's that. Let's not girl. get this misconstrued that Osiris was being emotional. Osiris was crying because certain people in the industry doesn't mess with him. That's not true. The reason I was crying, the reason that I was showing emotions, to let people know that other people feeling like this too. I show so much love. I so I show so much happiness and joy to people that I really love and I really mess with and I really look up to, but I don't get the same results. So that's the way I was feeling. And 
the devil trying to crush me, trying to break me down, he trying to break me to pieces, but I'm not going to let him do that. And, I, and the devil is a liar. I'm not going to let him do that. I'm a king. I am who I am. And I'm going to stay like that. I know where I stand for, and I stand for love. I stand for peace. I stand for happiness. And I'm, gonna, I'm not going to let nobody change that. And I'm so sorry to all my supporters and all my family that I showed that. But I just want to let people know that I love. I need to hit him up because he did just post that. Y'all saw that picture he posted on um, Twitter? <laughs> if it ain't about me. What picture? He got to do better. I ain't going to lie. I, I just honestly, man, I don't know. Like having money. And, like, having to be focused and shit, boy, I would have so much shit for myself. <laughs> I do it now. I have so much shit for myself just to to where I can go in my peaceful place. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all wonder why niggas play the game. After I'm done working, I need something to keep my mind going, bitch. Let me go ahead and start my game up. You get what I'm saying? I will work for 24 hours. And the only reason why I, I really be slowing down because my back be hurting because I'm holding up these titties. You know what I'm saying? But I'm trying to tell you. YK Osiris. He talking about his meat. I'm F-R-E-E. <laughs> it's K. All right, y'all. That's all I got for the uh, sugar honey ice tea. What is that? Y'all got it. Get into this. Y'all know I like to see one. We have Y'all know I like to see one every once in a while of these celebrities. Nah, I want to see uh I want to see it though. Send it to me. Baby versus academics. Child academics is Reduction. been all over the place lately. Oh, child. I, I don't want to go up under nobody's mouth unless I have to. I'm going to keep these titties forever, girl. Me instead of Fanny Willis. Oh man. Spend the block. Rap about really Next on the ducket. Next on the ducket, we got Gorilla versus Hit Kid. Ooh, now, for those who don't she know, played Hit Kid, herself I guess, on this. The guy who found these ladies and then he was producing songs for them, whatever case they be. She woo, played woo, herself woo, on this. Kirk is. He people were saying he's the one that wrote the hook <laughs> Just on Eminem. F R E E B N E B N E B N E B N E B N E B N E B N E B N E B she says she wrote everything on her phone. So anyway, he comes out of nowhere and he tweets, I did my best to protect you and those girls. This is the only portion of what I've been through. I'm bringing light to this before the word gets out that I'm the bad guy. I'm a stand-up guy and I stand on business and morals. But I'm just like, sometimes I feel when people do that, when they try to clear the smoke before the smoke come, maybe you were the fire that started to smoke. I told you and your manager every day that we was in LA with Sweetie, but the labels are gonna try to sign you because of F and M. I also told you, let me know when they tried to play her? out so we could be on the same <laughs> page, the but you up. still went and signed my song without telling me. So basically these folks are trying to take me to court and sue me for F and M because they want to own the song, but they want to own the song and put it on this EP, which both parties knew. So tell me how you're gonna put F and M in the contract without telling me after. So anyway, Chuck, he goes on and still tries to make himself seem like this nice guy, whatever the case may be. Granted, yeah, you found the women, y'all work so together. And you know, sometimes people when? come to a fork and in a row where y'all go your own separate ways. It's not that they don't still fuck with you, it's just now you got them to where they are. Because you did her so well, other people want to work with you and you can build them up. But now that this is going on, it's going to be like, ooh, this is a little mess, That's when Gorilla finally come out and she say, you know what, look, I don't clear up no room unless they say my coochie ain't ain't that. And I'm like, damn. Well, damn. <laughs> so anyway, she said, y'all can do whatever y'all want these clowns are saying. Niggas is being salty because I didn't sign to their label to be in <laughs> He sold it for 50K because he did not know how big it would be. For zero dollars. And who did he sell it to? Yo, got it? First week without me knowing for 50K. <laughs> <laughs> I 
day. But you didn't know how big it was going to be. You done made so much money off of FNF. I haven't made one red cent. I mean, other than the shows. But I'm still prospering because I can rap in real life. Uh, I wrote every single lyric and every single song that I ever put out. And even after all this, I still got love, as she mentioned his name. She even though you've been doing shit behind my book. back every since. I just hate the fact that you had to bring our business to the internet. Woo, 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 yada, yada, yada. Now, anyway, if you- She crazy for giving uh, Yo Gotti 100% of her royalties. What the fuck be wrong with these folks? They just being, you know, fuck the positions, I feel like, and, and that money look real good, you know, but. Really look at this. It Glorilla Leo, let's go. Now, that was a crazy move. That was an impulse move. An uh, impulse Leo move. I've made many, but I will make too many now. It kind of sounds like he was being sneaky in the beginning. So when you are a producer, right, and if both y'all ain't blowing up, granted, he took the girl in, I, I, from what the word on the curve is saying, he took her in when she was homeless. She's still and close they to made cancer, friend. Together. He didn't charge yeah, her she for damn nothing. damn that cancer, yada, yada, yada. But then for her to say he went and sold the song for 50K, don't look over that, y'all. He sold the song for 50K because he did not think it was going to blow up. Now it blew up. That's probably why they're going to court because she wants to put the song on her EP, but she can't because I guess they sold it to somebody else, but he ended up selling it without her knowing. So now they have to do all of this. But if you're saying, oh, you did this and you fucked with her, woo, 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 we don't know what y'all did behind the scenes. That's why it's always good to put stuff even when it's your friend, your family, when it's dealing with money and something could possibly happen, right. do contracts, sign papers, yeah, don't do this shake hands right. shit because when somebody starts to blow up, yep. people start feeling entitled, Girl, they start getting greedy, right. yep. and then it's, oh, well, we were friends, I helped yep. you out, I did this for free, and yep. woo, 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 woo. if we friends, then let me go on and get this song Hello. so I can do this. How you know she's not going to look out for you? I don't know. Whatever the case may be, it seems like they just don't bump heads. They need to just move the fuck on. He getting upset. I want to say this so bad because he make it sad. plain as day and so simple. And people don't hear so simple minded and just by, I don't even, my label means with me. I'm like, me and he kid a good duo, you know what I'm saying? Like, if I, I'm telling him, if I sign y'all, you know what I'm saying? I want him to come with me. I'm saying that the whole time. And then another thing he kept saying, it was, I can't remember ex exactly what it was about. But he ended up saying, if they want you, they're going to have to pay me. I forgot what exactly what amount he it's said. He so said between 100K or 500K. They're going to have to pay me for this song. He got the same thing after he kept saying labels called me. So I'm like, he on some other shit. So he's saying I use CMG lawyers. My lawyer is not a CMG lawyer. He was trying to get me to use his lawyer, though. He was like, use my lawyer, use my lawyer. No, I'm not using your lawyer, you man, because I'm not using your lawyer. I, I used another lawyer, and he not CMG lawyer. He wrote that bar. He just said, say it again at the end. That's the only thing he contributed to that song. I glory. Do you know if they add anything to the song? Like, like if you add anything to a song, like if a producer do, then that nigga can be, like, that nigga can have parts in that whole song, basically. Hey, two BT awards, right? I won artist of the year, but my song F and F ain't win. If F and F would have won, me and him would have won the award. Bam, that didn't happen. I won. Jealousy. All right, well, <laughs> it ain't about Jealousy. me. Let's get keep this case. Next on the docket, we got uh Sukiano versus. I can't give away a hundred percent, bro. Ah. Oh. I think it's pronounced Chica Chica. Anybody? I don't know. The girls. <laughs> The girl is girling, not an I mean girling. We're gonna just call her Shy because it's C H I K A. Shy. Shy had for her two cents in. And Sukiana was kind of like, you know, girl, shut the fuck up. You ain't had nothing to do with that. That's between them. Same way you jumped in with me and Cupcake was talking our shit. So now, bitch, I'm gonna come for you, bitch, because she's telling the girl she was built like a. <laughs> 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 Anyway, y'all came out and said it's always a build body bitch trying to fat shame somebody. If you pay for any part of your body, please don't feel like you got the room to body shame anybody. I ain't gonna lie, I don't really understand this either. Respectfully, God gave me my throat for music. I <laughs> said, whoa. <laughs> no, uh, we want two, three, four, five, God and this gave you your throat for rent. <laughs> Well, 
trying to tweak his that cupcake was shaped like a tablet. the girl it's like you Yes, cuz I won't say too much. I'm Bought it. Something you have with your organs. Bought it. Not this long. Uh, so. Now this, y'all. I'm gonna tell you now. I'm gonna tell you now. I am not about to go through every fucking tweet. I'm gonna tell you now. I am not about to go through every fucking tweet. Text. Yeah, the tablet is just this. This was too fucking much. If you didn't watch it the day it happened, I am sorry, baby. What we finna do right now is pick and piece and here and there and dibble and dabble and nibble and dabble. Okay? Don't don't say, oh, so you let this out. You let that out. I don't give a fuck. These bitches was tweeting for three hours. You think I'm gonna drive out that shit for three hours? No, ma'am. I'm just gonna get down to the nitty gritty. So anyway, Nikki had went live and she discussed a situation that didn't sit right with her. Super freaky girl. Yeah, we done already went through this. Was removed from rap categories. We found out today in the Grammy submissions, right? We literally already watched this too. Super freaky girl. Where I only rapped on the song was removed out of rap categories at the Grammys, right? Oh, we out. <laughs> so it's given we <laughs> Okay, we are how long? Girl, yeah, we done. Well ah! Y'all made it so much easier for me. Four 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 when the chin set. <clears throat> Listen, y'all, a lot of videos I've done this week. Um I actually have done a lot of worldly things and I'm going to continue to do worldly things. So y'all, um, we done with this video. We already got into it. My league don't even want to see it. You dig? Um, I love y'all so much. I appreciate y'all. We are on to the next video. Later.